Risk it. Nice. Nice fries. Nice whiskeys over here. I might as well share it with you. Glenn, where are we? Platte Plate Clove Wilderness Preserve. And we uh, rode about two hour, an hour and a half, two hours. You want to tell everybody where we're at? We're what at where exactly you slept slept us to? Preserve. Okay. What are we supposed to see here? Water a waterfall. Falling, water falling from a high point to a low point? Yes. Sixty feet. Sixty feet. Waterfall Good trail, job. overlook trail. This today is like, I call it a condensed uh, ride with, we have only street guide uh, Steve. Jag, AKA, AKA just Glenn. Just ask. We literally just, uh, Glenn and Steve helped me give uh, Blackbird its last farewell today. And uh, we just rode off into the sunset. Into the sunset. Oh, oh, nice, uh, nice day, huh? Yeah. Well, according to this site 18, is it this? So then the water is to our right? I guess. But that looks pretty far. Dude, if it's more than a uh, six minute walk, I'm not walking. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's walk down this way a little bit. Bushkill Falls is worse than this. Bushkill? Yeah, I was at Bushkill. The fucking trail you got down there, as I see it. Oh, we see the falls. Oh, yeah, wow. Steve, come on, it's here. Oh, uh, shit. Yeah, you right in. Wearing my stupid underwear. Wow, that's really cool. Look at that. Beautiful. I'm going in. Oh my god. How do we get get it through down here? Wow, look at that. Wow, 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 wow. Hello. That's really cool. Wow, nice. Wow. Wow. Again, words cannot describe. Yeah. So there's like such a breeze. The water is falling and it's moving massive air. And you feel like a, an AC over here, a very powerful air conditioner over here, blowing cold air on it. How cold is the water? 
Oh, it's freezing. It's freezing. Glenn went in. That's Glenn. Glenn is in there. <laughs> Come on, hurry up. <laughs> well, it is some of a ascent climbing up the yeah, Mount Everest. Yeah. It's hard. Wait. Oh, how you doing? Good. Look at these beautiful pieces of uh, art. I'm gonna put this on camera because uh, this might put a little pressure on Steve. We had Harley Davidson, Woodstock Harley Davidson, and, and Stevie is looking over here at uh, the beautiful uh, CBO. What is it called? What color is it? What is the? Steel, blue steel, blue steel. Blue steel, it's gorgeous. We're trying to take it out to the sun so we get to see. Oh, that's cool. Do it halfway down so you can see it. That is beautiful. I like that the forks are on the bike. So now you're on, you're on camera, so you, you, might, you need to buy that bike. Glenn pretty much talked him into buying this bike. Sparkle because the, sh the little spark Any changes from and and uh, the chrome, uh, the blacked out black chrome, the same technique that they use uh, with uh, the, cr the chrome works, even the heads. He's got the Kahuna pack on it. One mile ad, it's used. One mile, then it's used. One mile on your It's got a like uh, sensor shift or sensor in it, so that way, like, when you walk by our man, you want to be able to keep that Every tape, the adjust, I don't know if it's up on the 21st. Guys, halfway low, 2015. Guys, <laughs> Joe Clean sold That's so easy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they get the best of both worlds, right? I didn't realize how short the shot's going to be. It is sharp looking, man. It's a nice bike. The CBO's for 22. Come with the latest set. Actually, the floorboards has that finish. It's going all the way through. Oh, yeah, it does. It's going all the way back to the passenger pegs. It's got it on the heel toe shifter. Yep. Everything. Beautiful. Like I said, when you, if you see it inside, when you turn on, all the CBO badges right here and everything go around. Glenn got the best, the best uh, dish over here. Brisket, nice, nice fries, and you got ribs. And I got brisket as well, brisket sandwich. 
How are we doing? Good. Welcome. Awesome. 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 Can I get something out of your way? Thank you. Let's dig in. I'm full already for us from the, the starters. That lunch was something else. It was really good. Highly recommended Hickory. Hickory Barbecue Smokehouse Lunch and Dinner. Uh, we're at Woodstock, New York. What route is this? Which route? Route 28 in Kingston. 28 in Kingston. Try it out. Really good. I'm going to add this one. Uh, I'm going to ride back home. Guys, thank you for watching. I'm Sandy, and you are watching Holy Shift. Long, good day. Blackbird was gone, and this ride was really good. Until the next video, guys, peace out. So across the street from Hickory Restaurant, there's this, a tiny home, we'll call it, a shack, where it's like a modern... Very nice. What is it, a modern... Uh, a modern shack. Shack, modern way of living. It's, it looks really cool. It's got a loft. Yeah. Dude, I can live in something like oh, this. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Got a bathroom, a nice bathroom. Bathroom, a nice kitchen. living, not huge, but like. I think it's, it's, it's when the kids move out. Wow, you want a couple? I'm living this. This is nice. This would be good up in the up in the and your property. Yeah. Put one of these up there. Yeah. What is it called? <laughs> Modern Shack. Can we see better from here? Oh yeah! Wow, dude, this is really nice. How many square foot you think this thing is? 800, uh, 800, 800, 700, I would but say it's, 800. Two, it's two it's stories. To uh, that's really cool yeah, just to put on a, a piece of land. Yeah, absolutely. To use. Be nice at the top of the overnight. Look at the lights. Alternative space to live, yeah. love, create, claim. No way, no way, no way, dude. This is fifty between fifty and a hundred thousand. Probably a hundred grand. No, you're wrong. You're wrong. I got, I got a card. Glenn is buying already. They're counting. Okay. How much? How much is this six hundred and twenty square foot home? Before. Okay, thank you very much. $320 a square foot. Times 600. And 180,000 then. Yes, he was right. That's overpriced. $200,000, too much. <laughs>